Hi there, welcome to Be A Surface Pro. Today's Surface Pro tip is get to know your trackpad. If I'm sitting at a desk for any length of time, I'd prefer to use a mouse than a trackpad because it's better ergonomically. But when you're on the go, then a trackpad is quite handy and it's handy to know a few tips that can make life a little bit easier when you're using your trackpad. The touchpads on all of the Surface products are all nice clean glass squares that don't have any defining buttons. But in Windows, the bottom right hand corner of any touchpad is a right click button. I'll show you how you can turn this off, but I get a lot of people who are moving across from a Mac and they're not used to having that right click button in the bottom right hand corner. So if you're in that boat and you're adapting to Windows, then that's one of the things that you might wanna change is turning off the right click zone on the bottom right corner. For everybody else, just be aware that there is a right click spot there. And if I click there, you'll see that it brings up a context menu by clicking on the right hand button on your mouse. The other way that we can right click with Windows is to put two fingers down on the trackpad. Touch anywhere else on the touchpad with one finger and that's a single click. To scroll up and down, just use two fingers to move up and down the trackpad to scroll the page. Make a pinch gesture to zoom in and out. There are also three and four finger gestures on your touchpad that you can use. And to find out more of these, let's have a look at the settings application. So if you click on your Windows Start menu and you click on the settings button and jump into devices and you'll see a section there for touchpad. Please note that the touchpad needs to be connected or the keyboard needs to be connected in order for you to see this section of settings. If you don't have it connected at the time, this one won't show up. In the touchpad settings in Windows, you'll see in here that we can customize what a single click, a right click, a left click does, the sensitivity of our scrolling and zooming. And then underneath that, you'll see three fingered and four fingered gestures. So for example, three fingers up on the trackpad actually brings up the Windows task view or timeline view. Three fingers moving in a downwards direction will actually show the desktop and minimize all of your open applications. Swiping with three fingers across the trackpad will switch you to the last app that you were using. And there are even four finger gestures on the trackpad. For example, if you're using multiple desktops, you can swipe across with the trackpad with four fingers to switch between open desktops. If you found this tip helpful, remember to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more Surface Pro tips. The Surface Touch Pads or track, oh, yeah, let's just go with touch pad. The Surface Touch Some of the tips and tricks that can make using this trackpad a lot easier. Touchpad, trackpad. Uh.